mindful eating. Uh huh. Yeah, I heard you talk about that. Yeah. It is so important, and I know Jack talked about it, you know, uh -huh. what goes into your body, how it's prepared, the feeling uh -huh. and the passion of the food that you're preparing. Uh -huh. In your, how do you try with the chefs and with, if this not in profit, what uh -huh. is mindful eating to you? Right, right. Um, let me give you an example of one thing we do here that I think demonstrates that. So we, we have uh, dinner together every Thursday night, everyone from the farm, the education center, and the restaurant. We all gather for uh, How many people? Pasta dinner. It's usually like 125. Wow. And we always have a presentation from someone interesting. So a few weeks ago, we had a group here that um, develops different kinds of salt. Mm -hmm. We have all kinds of growers come. There was a pal palmologist here a few weeks ago talking about the fruit he grows. But one of the things we do is called anatomy of a dish. And what happens with that is we pair a young farmer and a young chef, and we say, go out into the landscape and onto the farm and create a dish that reflects this place, that reflects the ecology of this place, and that also helps you tell a story about yourself, about how you ended up here, why you love food, why you cook, why you farm. And then we ask them to share the dish, so they talk about the dish they created, and they talk about kind of their personal story and their thinking about how they put, pulled the dish together. Um, so uh, people end up talking about gardening with their grandparents. People end up talking about bad food experiences they have and wanting something different. People talk about connection to land. They talk about connection to each other. So to me, mindfulness is, it can come through many threads. You know, for some, like I'm a very deeply interested in conservation. So for me, it's about conservation. Um, for others, it's about tradition and deliciousness of family cooking. For others, it's about being the best grower. Um, but I love that project because it, it gives the young people on the farm the chance to really express like what is mindfulness to them through food.